So back in the middle of March, I spent a week in Tenerife with two half frame film cameras and 10 rolls of film. <laughs> And it was a great week. I took a lot of shots, so I'm gonna make a few videos on this topic, uh, just because it was like way too much to put into one video. Okay, so I went to Tenerife with my friend Stefan, who lives in Switzerland now. Uh, so we basically just see each other traveling now. <laughs> um, he's also a photographer. He has a great blog, great website. It's called photomoai.com. Um, he's also on TikTok a lot. So if you like TikTok content, then go follow him there. So day one, we headed over to Los Gigantes. Um, Stefan, um, unfortunately, he has really bad luck with whale watches. And I think he brought that with us on this trip because we did not see any whales. We did see dolphins, though. So I will have some a second of B-roll from that. <laughs> So yeah, in order for us to get to Los Gigantes, we had to drive through some pretty windy roads, which was fun going there, not fun on the way back because I think it made me a little sick. <laughs> In the morning before we went, I realized that I had loaded a roll of Rolei Superpan 200 into the Fujika half. So like day one, I was super excited. I was, think I was going to load some Ektar or something. Um, I say it in the video. But yeah, I went to go load it, film the whole thing, and then open the back of the camera and realized there was film in there. So I was like, oh, well, I don't want to waste the film. We'll see how it turns out because it might not be ruined. Um, it did mean that it went through an airport scanner in Bristol. Um, but it actually, looking at the film, it seems totally fine. So yeah, so I shot a roll of Rolei Super Pan 200, which is what the black and white images are from this day. And then I loaded a roll of Adox Color Mission into the Agfa photo half frame camera. And I actually think these photos came out incredible. Like for this plastic camera for 25 pounds, these images are great. With a simple mind, we should find some more time. We don't need to worry at all. Yeah, the boat trip was gorgeous. I mean, so like we took the boat to these cliffs and they're just like, you're literally right next to them. And it's just incredible. It is such an awe, awe moment. Um, and yeah, I took some photos on the, both the Agfa photo half frame black and white and the Fujika oh, half. Cause you know I'll be there in a hurry.
So yeah, that was our first day in Los Gigantes and the morning spent in Puerto de la Cruz where I went on a little coffee exploration. Um, I It was the first day, so I hadn't got, we hadn't gone to the grocery store. I actually went to the grocery store in the morning to get more coffee, uh, but I found a little coffee place down in the town area and I found a supermarket, got my coffee, <laughs> which is very important. And uh, the apartment had a coffee maker, so that was absolutely perfect. And I was sorted for the rest of the week. Good morning. We have just arrived to the hotel last night. Um, pretty late because we, when we, when we landed in the airport by plane, they wouldn't let us be bored for an hour. Um, it is. 8.15 in the morning. We did stay up there late last night. Um, but today, it's gonna be one of the warmest days. So once we get ourselves going, we're gonna go and try and find a whale watch. Um, but I've just popped out for a morning supermarket run. And I thought it would be a good time to load up my first roll of the trip. I don't usually shoot Portra, but I do have I did buy like a five pack of Portra 160 and a five pack of Portra 400 like two years ago and they've just been sitting in the fridge. So I thought it would be a good chance to bring, bring one. So it's going in the half frame camera so it will stretch out its usage. So I totally take that back. Um, it appears I've already loaded some Rolly Super Pan 200 film in here, <laughs> which I've just flashed now. So those frames are ruined. Um, but after we finish this, we'll load the Portra 160. So the black and white scans, I scanned on my Plus Tech just because I wanted, I usually, I'd, I'd use the pixelator, but I wanted higher resolution just because they were half frame photos and I was zooming in on the one image, on the one half frame. So I wanted higher resolution, which is why I use the Plus Tech, but the color photos I got developed at Analog Wonderland and I had them scan it for me in the two frames in one image. So I think... If I get, when I get those negatives back, I'm gonna scan them on my plus tech to get the higher resolution. And I think those images will be even sharper because the black and white images scanned on the plus tech are just incredibly sharp. So this camera is amazing. I mean, it's plastic, it's cheap, it's fixed settings, but that's also kind of liberating in a way because I didn't think about settings. I was just thinking about the composition and shooting which was very fun when you're traveling and you're like doing things and you're with people. Um, it's just so much easier just to like set it and forget it. Yeah, that was our first day. And I think I'm gonna do videos by the day just because we did so much each day and there's just so much video and images to share from each day. So 
Um, yeah, we also, for the rest of the week, we went to El Tide, the volcano area. Uh, we went to Mesca, which is a beautiful mountain town. Um, we went to some, I think it's called Anaga or Anaga Forest, which is like so different. You wouldn't think it was in Tenerife because it was like cold and windy and mountainous. And they had these gorgeous mossy trees growing everywhere. And it was just stunning. Um, so I have more videos coming out about that. So if you are not subscribed, consider subscribing if you want to see more and you don't want to miss any. And also I will be putting updates here and there in my Substack newsletter. So if you want to sign up for that, there's a free option. Uh, I put it out monthly now. Uh, so you can sign up for that over there. Yeah, that's it for this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below and I will see you in the next one. Bye.